I'd like to introduce Bob from Scotland, who takes LDN for ME. Thank you for joining me, Bob. You're welcome. Could you tell me when you first noticed MS, um, ME symptoms? First notice ME symptoms? Mm -hmm. Well, I had it um, about 18 years ago, and I had it for about four years, and it left me. But I had a bad relapse, and it came back again, a lot worse. Mm -hmm. What were your symptoms? Uh, sleeplessness, uh, night sweats, weakness, uh, aversion to all noises and sounds and uh, smells, everything made me sick. Uh, I had to live in basement, my bedroom had to be blackened out, keep out all the light. Very sensitive to noise and other, you know, lights. Um, were you very fatigued? Very fatigued, extreme nausea. I was basically bed bound. What about pain? Uh, not so much pain, just, just nausea. Uh -huh. If you had to, at that time, score your quality of life on a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being the best, what would it have been back then? Uh, could you repeat that again, sorry? Your quality of life, if you had to rate it on a score of 1 to 10 at that time, 10 being at the best. At its worst, I'd say it would be about 0.5 out of 10. Oh my goodness, as bad as that. Oh yeah, I was bed bound, I, was, I could change my shirt, my t-shirt six times a day, that's such a bad fever. Oh yeah. It was just unbearable. Mm, sounds it. And how I did you hear it? How did you hear about LDN? Uh, how did I hear about that? Oh, it was an aunt from America that has a friend from Scotland who was on it, and she heard about it from a friend in Scotland, and she mm -hmm. phoned me from uh, Long Island, told me about it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I checked and it all out. And was it easy to get a prescription? It took me a wee while well to get a description, yeah. And it was letters back and forward and visits to the doctor and then the doctor had to write to worst hospitals for uh, clinical tests and so on and uh, that came back in a negative they weren't, when he weren't prepared to describe, describe, prescribe it to me. Right, okay. And when you first started being so ultra sensitive to everything, did you have to start on a very minuscule dose? Yeah, I started on the, the low dose. And what is it? Uh, the low dose is at 0 0.5, and then you got to 1 and 1.5. Mm -hmm. And by the time I got to 3.5, I would say within at the most six weeks, my terrible fevers had left me. About In 90 six weeks? Wow. Had left me. Mm -hmm. That was one of my worst symptoms. Right. So, how long have you been taking LDN for now? I would say that must be about six months now. Right. And what would you say your quality of life is now, Bob? Uh, it's works a lot better. I feel the way. Mm -hmm. I just like, I take it for that alone, you know, just to get rid of that. Yeah. Uh, I'm feeling more strength. It's gradual, but I'm feeling a lot. More strength, you know, I don't get so fatigued walking about the house or up down the stairs. I uh, don't know if it's so much nausea. Everything's improving slowly. Well, it's still six months, it's still early days for you. I would hope that you will get a lot more improvement, you know, over time. You I think I will because it's a gradual onset. Yeah. But the bonus was it took the fever away within five, six weeks, and that, that was just amazing. Mm hmm. What would you say to other people with ME who are thinking of trying LDN? I would say it's worth a shot. Give it six months and see how you get on. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you. Help me when nothing else could. <sighs> yes, exactly. Well, thank you very much for sharing your story with us. Well, you're very welcome. Anytime.